How can I stop melanin production in my skin? Hello and welcome. Today, we're diving into an intriguing topic that is related to our skin, its color, and how we can influence it. We're talking about melanin. Melanin is a natural pigment produced by cells in our skin known as melanocytes. But can we control its production? Let's find out. What is melanin? Melanin is a pigment produced in the skin, eyes, and hair of humans and animals. It gives us our complexion, hair color, and the color of our eyes. Melanin plays a crucial role in protecting our skin from the harmful ultraviolet rays of the sun. It absorbs UV radiation and disperses it as heat. Can I stop melanin production? It's crucial to note that you cannot and should not completely stop melanin production. As I mentioned earlier, melanin has a vital role in protecting our skin from harmful UV rays. Without it, we're at a higher risk for skin cancer, premature aging, and other adverse skin conditions. However, it is possible to control or reduce excessive melanin production. This can help in treating hyperpigmentation or dark spots. Let's discuss the ways to achieve this. How can I control or reduce melanin production? There are several ways to control or reduce melanin production. 1. Use of sunscreen. Consistent use of a broad-spectrum sunscreen with a high SPF can protect your skin from harmful UV rays, which trigger melanin production. 2. Topical creams. Over-the-counter and prescription creams containing ingredients like hydroquinone, azelaic acid, kojic acid, niacinamide, or vitamin C can help reduce melanin production. 3. Professional treatments. Laser treatments, chemical peels, or microdermabrasion can help reduce excess melanin. 4. Diet. Eating foods rich in vitamin C and antioxidants can help regulate melanin production. Remember to always consult with a healthcare or skincare professional before starting any treatment. What are the risks? Reducing melanin production can have potential risks. Overuse of skin lightening products can cause skin irritation and damage. Furthermore, reducing your skin's melanin can make it more susceptible to UV damage, increasing the risk of skin cancer. It's always important to prioritize skin health over skin color. Understanding melanin and its functions helps us appreciate its importance to our skin health. While it's possible to control melanin production to some extent, we should be mindful of the potential risks involved. And remember, every skin color is beautiful. Until next time, keep your skin safe and healthy.